Go ahead and paint me red and black and call me jumper cables, baby, because I'm finna start some shit today. If you plan to be a sad bitch for the day, go take you a nappy nap, get a snack, and get yourself right. After that, come with me, there's fuckery to spread. Let's go. This is not a test. This is your emergency broadcast system, announcing the commencement of the annual purge, sanctioned by the U.S. government. Weapons of class 4 and lower have been authorized for use during the purge. All other weapons are restricted. Government officials of ranking 10 have been granted immunity from the purge and shall not be harmed. Commencing at the siren, any and all crime, including murder, will be legal for 12 continuous hours. hours, hours. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. You heard the woman. Sit down. Oh. <laughs> Betty is up and about <laughs> on a Monday morning. She is bright and early and bushy tailed. Y'all, I have got a throat problem right now. Y'all can hear it cracking. <laughs> I'm cracking over here, Val. It got worse. <clears throat> Let me clear my throat. <laughs> it's the pollen, y'all. It's the pollen. Yeah, tell her, Kendrick. Sit your ass down, Betty. Be hungry. Mondays is not for that, Betty. Mondays is not for that. No. But I'm Good glad morning. she chose happiness. <laughs> Good morning. God, I am cracking. You hear it, Val? It's worse. I've been talking too much today already. <clears throat> okay. Let me take a drink of water. <laughs> take your drink of water, hon. It's the pollen, man. It's killing me. It's killing me. I'm dying over here. For real. Good morning, everyone. I'm so happy y'all are here. We are back. It is Monday. It is, what's the temperature here? It is 62 degrees here and sunny in North Carolina. And I'm ready for the eclipse. 
Look, even my yeah. even my picture there. I'm ready for the eclipse. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm a little afraid. What do y'all think about the eclipse? You know, it's they start happening here after lunch, ain't it? Girl, they're already firing off missiles from NASA. What? <laughs> True what? story. Yeah, they're firing rockets off, baby. Before, during, and after. Mm. A lot of people are saying they <clears throat> they can't see it because it's raining and cloudy where they are. Well, I am scared, Kathy. I'm terrified. <laughs> Kathy, you will still experience it. It'll go dark. But you won't get to see the, the you know. I'm scared because it's going to cause earthquakes. Look, I had a whole meltdown at the Sunday dinner table yesterday because they were laughing at me. <laughs> if you don't knock it off. <laughs> Jordan, all of them were laughing at me because I was like, there's supposed to be earthquakes. <laughs> That's it. That is it. Me and Sav Sav will be doing Bible study. <laughs> We, yeah. we will be starting her Bible studies because Sav Sav is My terrified. mama was really impressed to me. Uh, <clears throat> she was impressed that I was telling them youngins about the about the end times, the revelation. Yeah, I know. Yeah, because you beat it into me, Shirley. <laughs> <laughs> of course I'm going to know it. <clears throat> I got beat by the Bible. Dang it, go on. Dang, yeah, Shirley. Oh we all was on the front pews listening to that preacher. There wasn't a kid alive. There wasn't a kid alive in a Baptist church when you was little. Not hey, radar. Hey, everybody coming in. Hey, hey, what? hey. I see y'all. I see y'all. Thank y'all for the Come on now. I don't know, but I'm a little afraid. They saying the earthquakes are going to start happening. Uh, California going to fall off into the Pacific. Uh, we're going to have a whole new map of the. Jordan got up from the table and went and got tin foil and put it on my head and said, "Look, Daddy, <laughs> this is safer." <laughs> See, I don't just get it up here; I get it in the family too, y'all, for real. <laughs> well, look, Sav, Sav. Okay, there, the scriptures do tell us, right, that not even the angels themselves know when he's coming. Mm -hmm. So I ain't worried about that. I'm worried about a big tidal wave. I'm two and a half hours from the coast. <laughs> Do you understand? <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, girl. This is what I'm afraid of. I don't know what to tell you. Learn to swim or get or get to talking I, to Jesus. I, I don't know what to tell you. Look, Jim and I, Mama's in here. She's right. Look, because we Gemini's, we see this shit. That, yeah, we see it, don't we, girl? We see it. It's the red heifer sacrifice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hold on tight, girl. I don't know. I'm just a little worried because if an earthquake comes over here, what if it causes a great big tidal wave? I'm done for y'all. I'm done. <laughs> I'm not <laughs> again. Me and Sav oh, Sav will be in private Bible studies. <laughs> all I know is that I'm just, I hope it's swift and painless. That's all I know. I just hope it's quick. If I'm going out of here, just make it quick. Well, if it's if it's a tsunami, then don't pedal. That's all. I don't know what to tell you. Don't swim. I, run I don't know. Run, swim. I don't know what to tell you. I can swim. But that'll be a whole lot of swimming. I'm, I'm almost 50. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> I'm just going to get in the closet and pray. <laughs> Read the Bible, Callie. Come on, Callie. We got to get in the prayer closet. Girl, you know what's going on, right? Huh. Shirley has got them women praying for you, girl. I guess. Mm -hmm. I guess. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> just let, just know we all love you. Oh, I know. All right. I'm, y'all, I'm getting terrified. It's too early to be scared. <laughs> Look at poor little on me, big bad, big badass over here, scared. Well, like I said, I'm still here reading articles. NASA's firing off rockets, trying to study this and study that, and I'm like, it is kind of crazy. Though. Well, it, it don't it have is. to be a billions of dollars of rockets to let y'all know people like crazy during eclipses and full moons and <laughs> what, T. Barry? What? Look at this, file. 
Well, at least we're not throwing people off icon temple temples into pits of fire this time. Huh, did they really do that? Yeah. Yeah. Holy shit. Well, that would be quick and I mean, you just bam, you you disintegrated. That would be a quick one, a quick way to go. I don't, I got a fear of drowning. I have a really big, that's a phobia of mine of drowning and suffocating. Oh, you know Every what? Every time I, I think have, of that water, you know. If they're sacrificing virgins, I think we're good. Oh, that, I, I don't <laughs> oh. oh my God. Maybe it's just my phobia coming out. <laughs> drowning and suffocating. I don't know. I don't know. You over there wearing that thing, that's why I told you I couldn't ever do that. I couldn't be in the danger zone with that mask you have to wear because I feel like I'm suffocating. I Girl, couldn't fight. If my doctor don't do something tomorrow, he and I are going to have to have a, a chitty chat. Because I, I, I can't keep waking up every night, y'all, with a squid on my face farting. I, I just, I, I, I'm going to video it for y'all. Y'all will die laughing. Y'all will die that. laughing. <laughs> Hold on, looking at something. Where is? Where is it? I know I recorded it. I just gotta find it. I'm telling y'all, it's been a rough, rough weekend. Oh my god, I know I did. Not. We're gonna talk about it over because he, I cannot, I can, I cannot. Like they're telling me, I need this because I'm a flopper. I flopped to one side to the other. <laughs> Who's a flopper? You? I'm a flopper girl. I go to my left. Then I go to my right. right. I oh, we got an announcement my... tomorrow. We got an announcement, Val. Tell them about our announcement for tomorrow. We're an hour late, y'all. We're going to yeah, be an hour late because of Val. <laughs> Come on. I am. I'm, I'm going to march right in there in the morning. So we won't be live until 11 <clears throat> tomorrow, y'all. We'll be at 11 tomorrow. Y'all get to sleep in an extra hour. How about that? I'm going to let y'all sleep in. Class, the bell won't ring until 11 o'clock tomorrow. 11. <laughs> I'm going to go in there and I'm going to call him by his first name. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Yep. Um, not doctor this or not. No, mm -mm. First name only. First name only basis. I'll be at work tomorrow, Sassy. So you didn't take the day off for the uh, eclipse? Oh, tomorrow. That's tomorrow. See, I'm already crazy. I'm all discombobulated right now, thinking about that tidal wave. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> In the earthquakes. I went down the rabbit hole last night on Ticker Talker. I even dreamed about it, y'all. I dreamed about this eclipse. I was out there looking at it with no glasses on, and I went blind. Savage, <laughs> you <laughs> <laughs> That's it. We're getting a wish list. You're getting a canoe. <laughs> I did. I, was, I even dreamed it. <laughs> I did. I was like, this is bad. This is bad if I'm dreaming it. I woke up into a panic. Because if you go ask damn Alexa, she says an earthquake's going to happen at 10 o'clock this morning. Or 10 Alexa, or need, Alexa needs to shut up, <laughs> mind her own business. This <laughs> is getting me all wound up, worried up, Val. Got my voice cracking and everything. <laughs> you know, she needs to mind her own. Where can I call? Where can I talk to this Alexa? <laughs> mind your own, woman. Yep. Would I, hey, do I need to go get a tip inside, Jeezy? Or am I safe? He outside right now. Do I need to get him? Do I need to get my dog? Somebody let me know. Get in the bathtub. We'll get in the bathtub. <laughs> when all that spells, run for the tub. <laughs> get a match. Do I need to go get my dog in? Good Lord, he already had deaf. I don't need him half deaf and blind. That's right. Alexa ain't no. Who are you, a meteorologist, Alexa? Can you imagine us fighting with Alexa? Who they're saying go, there's why the eclipse is going on. Keep dog in the house so they don't. When's it supposed to happen? We ain't getting none of them things. So I think we're safe, ain't we? Am I safe? <laughs> Hell, I don't even know. <laughs> bye bye. Get in the house. <laughs> if y'all have not picked up on the hints, 
it's your moment to troll Sam. <laughs> I think you're trolling me. I think I got a bunch of trolls it's here. Your moment. You know, it is your moment to troll her. Yeah, because I'm believing everything about this. <laughs> I need to go get my dog. <laughs> I don't know when it's starting here, uh, Stephanie. When's it starting here? Somebody look it up. I'm, I won't even mean it. What do I need to type in Google? When's the eclipse coming to North Carolina? <laughs> North Carolina, solar. Yo, God. Don't got me over here. <laughs> Get my listen, to, listen to her back away over here, y'all. <laughs> when is... Here we go. Will North Carolina see the solar eclipse? It's going to be solar. here. Do I bring my dog in? Okay, I got a time. I got a time. 3.14 p.m. All right, he'll be inside then. He'll be inside. Okay. 3.14, no matter where y'all are at, I want everybody to stop. Say a little prayer for Sap Sap because she'll be in a closet. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be going to pick up that, I'll be picking up that baby. That's what I'll be doing at 3.14. You I'll will get to thinking about that and go get that baby. And y'all will, you will get that baby in a closet. Y'all be sitting there waiting for it to get dark outside. Yep. All right. It says while North Carolina is in the path of the total of the totality of the solar eclipse today, even here in the Tario State, we'll see a sliver of the since whatever that says at three fourteen p.m. Monday. All right. So I got a little while. I ain't got to get Bud Bud in yet. Okay. We're done. All right. Thanks for that. Now I know three fourteen. Well, at least now you know. At least now you know when your death is coming at three fourteen. Yeah, I was about to say that. At least I got a few more hours. <laughs> <laughs> a few more hours and ain't gonna I ain't gonna end up <laughs> killing us over here while I'm live. <laughs> that would be some shit. Tidal <laughs> right, waves coming. Look at there. Here it comes. The end is near. Three fourteen. It comes down on three fourteen, April eighth for Savage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, I'm tired of talking about it now. I'm getting wound up. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. I need to get my mind clear. Shake this shit off because y'all got me worked up. Now I come up here with this picture at the backstage and Savage <laughs> goes, What are you doing? I said, I'm ready, girl. I'm she ready for the eclipse. <clears throat> she ready to meet her maker, honey. Well, y'all know what? We're going to keep it right on moving. Oh, wait a minute. We got, Before we get into her, we got to re, let's recap real quick about the weekend, what happened this weekend. Oh. So you, so you know this happened. Let me get my little picture up. Where did it go? Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. I could say something really funny right now, but I know it would be inappropriate. Okay, about well, then, we that would probably be you to not do it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's the devil on one side, the angel on the other. <laughs> this right here, because we were live Saturday. If y'all missed it, we were live Saturday. Because uh, this stuff right here happened. Old JLR wanted to uh, make a claim in his Facebook group over there that a guy was running around, came up with a gun. In his hand to confront the peaceful Sebastian rally. Multiple police are here. Police are now looking for a Jaden guy. Well, shortly after we went live, Queen B went live and actually had the young man up there and explained everything. Cause so they lied about this boy, right? Mm -hmm. They lied. About they I guess somebody yeah. told him. I guess nobody told him Tennessee is an open carry state. Like, you can, as long as you ain't threatening folks with it, like, you can walk around with a gun yeah. on your hip, like the Wild Wild West. Now, we did watch the video. We watched it. We watched everything, and mm -hmm. we broke it down. Mm -hmm. He did not brandish no gun. No, now, he, he, did. Did admit to, <clears throat> he did admit having one on his hip and that he was resting his hand on it just for his safety because he didn't know what. You know, somebody could have come up and started shit with him. You know? Yep. And you can have a gun in Tennessee. It's open carry. You don't have to have no paperwork or no nothing. So, that was just an example of, oh, how these tragedy pimps over there lie. They just lie. They well, he didn't know, And here's another thing. He did not come across aggressive either. Like, No. The only thing he would say, he went up there and said was, um, 
what is this? How is this helping searching for Sebastian? Because these people were just side the road. Mm -hmm. They were just side the road videoing while cars just went by. And I had the same question. How is that helping that boy? How, how are you help searching just standing on the side of the, the damn road in a little shopping mall? Well, my thing is this. We demand, we demand this man to repent. Who we? Yeah. We don't serve we. And last I looked, the Almighty don't need you. Do you see what I'm saying? Like, who we? He was, would you say he was like the uh, Whisper? He was, yeah. like, he was one of them, y'all. He was one of them. He well, he, no, he was Whisper. acting like Westboro, you know, when they yeah. used to do the grotesque things at funerals and things like that, using it as a technique to be seen. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on, I'm looking for that other one. Let's see. Because y'all don't know if what we're talking about. I want to show you. Yeah, this right here. Here we go. Share this instead. That right there. That's what was outside that that on the street. That this is helping to search. Like we said Saturday. How is this helping? How is this helping y'all? You see what kind of jo jokes they are? All of them. And JR was standing like right there with him. Right there with him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not saying a mm -hmm. word. Yeah. But he got on uh he wanted to get on his uh, Facebook group and fire all of them up because you know he's got a pretty big Facebook group over there, y'all. Like 25k. Well, that, that's how they want to whip up a crowd. They want to whip up a crowd of anger and hostility and come on down and yeah. And it's, not help. it's not helping. I did have this one because this was actually at the visual that they had for that, that young man. And, um, <clears throat> and the grandparents speak. Now, I do want to explain something because people are already trying to say that you're a tragedy. You're a tragedy. You're picking out that boy. No, I'm not. Look, I'm going to tell you something. This is what I do. Anytime that I hear a family member address tragedy pimps and social media and telling them to stop, yes, I'm going to clip that because people need to hear that. I didn't. Mm -hmm. I could have had the whole video going up here and made bank off of it if I wanted to, but mm -hmm. I didn't like that. That's not what I stand for, okay? But anytime I hear people <clears throat> that are against tragedy pimping and telling these people to knock it off, yes, I'm clipping that. But guess what? You don't see nothing in my title with that boy's name in it. All I have is more words for the social media tragedy pimps. Hashtag ban tragedy pimps. I don't have no names in my shit. Well, not only that, it's kind of like showing you how people use social media. Like, okay, example. Oh, Lord, I'm going to have to talk about Caitlin Clark. Oh, my gosh. Okay, uh -oh. like right now we're seeing an uptick because the women's basketball has been real hot right mm. on social media and things like that well they've been taking uh clips and making it like these girls are fighting and saying stuff to each other on courts while they're playing well there was mm -hmm. a clip out there that it showed caitlin clark say something over to the side and then they they zoned in on her father and it looked like her father said shut up right mm -hmm. Well, in a press conference, she laughed. She said, I was not even talking to my father. Mm -hmm. You know, and we laughed about it, too, because I said, get real. Nobody's looking at your daddy in college playing basketball. Those days are over. Yeah. Right. Kids don't even do that when they reach a certain age, like nine and ten. They, they're, a lot of them start to zone mom and daddy out. Right. Uh -huh. uh, there was another photo of, um, I believe it was... Um, Another player who was pointing to her middle finger, and Caitlin Clark was standing in front of her on the court, and the uh -huh. girl was like, "I was not doing that to her. I was." They caught a still shot of her. She was about trying to call time, time out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So see, they're taking, they're using social media. They're taking snips here and snips there to make drama, 
and it's not even real, right? The same difference here with JLR going, there's a man brandishing a gun to overdraw, yeah, to make it overdraw, you know, make yeah. it drama for people to click his stuff. And really, that's it's not. All it is. I that's mean, the dangers it's, of social media. That's the dangers yeah. of social media, showing you things that's not truly going on. Mm -hmm. Well, here's what, um, okay, what we're seeing. This is Seth, the biological father, and these are his parents at the vigil. So I want y'all to hear this. Cause, but you know what the bad thing is? They're not going to... Um, they're not going to stop. Not even if the if the family members tell them knock it off. They're not. They will never no, stop. No, they're and not going to stop because it's not about them. It's about their wallet. Exactly, and that should speak volumes. When a when parents get up here and say stop it, don't use my kid as clickbait, and you don't stop it, you don't respect them enough to knock that kind of behavior off. That shows what you're really about. Mm -hmm. That mm -hmm. shows what you're really about. So here we go. We thank everybody for being here and for your prayers and for putting forth the effort to try to find and This is our second trip up from Texas. Uh, Just all the negativity that's going around needs to stop. It needs to stop. The negativity is not going to bring my son back. And, you know, it's it's... It, it just needs to stop. And these, you know, the YouTubers meet social media. Okay. But if it, you're It's about in a, what you're doing with it. Yeah. All right. If you're going to be positive, be positive. If you're going to be negative, you're not welcome. If you're going to get out here and, and pound the ground and look for him without your GoPro or whatever on, you're going to be out here doing what needs to be done to bring our grandson home. We appreciate, we appreciate it. it. But if you're out there you. just making money, stay away. <coughs> stay away. Yeah, my grandson's not clickbait. At the very end, did y'all hear that where she says, my grandson is not clickbait? Mm -hmm. Let me rewind it a little bit and play that again for you. So it's not clickbait. <laughs> yeah. My grandson's not here. Right so now when you see other ones that have, um, after that woman said that, right? Mm -hmm. How many of them still did their thumbnails with that boy's face in it? They were popping off left and right. And I tell you something right now. There's another little tragedy pimp I've got when the T Rev, T Rev, T Rev. I see you, Brittany. I see you. I see all of you. Except I haven't got to you yet. Don't mean we don't see you. I mean, look, they're doing the play by play. They're doing. They're going right down the playbook, right? <clears throat> yep. We watch them. Basically, bring a, a, a father who's looking for his son. He's asking for help. Yeah. And start dropping stuff on him just to get something bad to say about the other parent. Do you see what I'm saying? Just like the manipulation. Just, and I don't care who you are. You, if you're brought up on a pan, if somebody tells you anything about your child that you don't know, you're going to say, you're going to get mad and say something. Mm -hmm. Right. And then it yeah. just goes from there, right? And that's basically what they've done to Seth. They've got him up on panel. They've dropped stuff in front of him. He showed his anger because he's, I mean, let's face it. We're, he, everybody's looking for this young man. It's, this is his son. Yeah. And you know, parents, see, that Facebook is where all this is brewing from. Right, right. <laughs> I'm just, I'm in, taking, it, they know they know he's exhausted and they're they're taking advantage. Oh yeah, Felony Melanie are accusing the mom over on Facebook. Mm. See, they don't need to be getting involved. I'm telling you, they're drawing. Y'all need to get off social media for the sake of this young. Period, and that goes all around to every the parents, the step parents, uh, the grandparents, the sisters, the. The cousins, whoever's getting on uh, panels or going in these Facebook groups, running, just 
participating in it, you're you're messing shit up. You're doing harm, more harm than good. Yeah, you're not you're doing feeding, you're good. You're feeding drama people. I'm telling you. And they don't care about you. They will turn on you on a whim. Wait till Betty turns on the biological father. Wait for that. Because it's coming. It is coming. Mm-hmm. It's yeah. definitely coming. The only thing right now, the push needs to be getting this boy's face out. End of getting his face out there. I mean, look, there are still people in this country that don't even, believe it or not, they don't even know about this child, even though you think it's everywhere. It's been on Nancy Grace. It's been here. It's been there. There are still people that don't even know about this child. So right now, the main push would be getting his face out there. Not this other stuff. His face. That's the most important thing. His face needs to be out there. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah, twin thing, I agree. Oh, wait a minute. What did you say? It's become about the parents and not about the missing. As right. per you. Yeah. It's become yep. about the dirty laundry. You oh, know, yeah. the, the, the <laughs> rather than where is Sebastian? And every little thing that, that will come out about either the parents, stepfather, whatever, that's just, oh God, that's just like you're feeding them pieces of crap over there. Them tragedy pins. I know? mean, what did the, I'm trying to figure out what the end game is. What, y'all think these parents are going to come out and go, okay, we give. We're going to tell yeah. you. No, they're not. If if they are who you say they are, no, they're not. And you know they're not. You're just doing this to make money for your channel. That's it. No, travel gal. She didn't go travel gal. She is waiting till the 21st when everybody has cleared out. And that was her words. That's what she said. Mm-hmm. Show did. I got it on I got the screenshots on my community page. Sure do. She states she's going on the 21st. Cause she got caught on the 17th and she gotta be in Illinois. <laughs> 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 That's what held her back. <coughs> Chris's RV, no. Did not. I got some videos to review. Lord have mercy, Jesus. Well, it's time, y'all. Get your pen and paper out. It is time. Oh, Lord, it's Get ready. It is time for the best room. Yeah. Woohoo! Here's Betty. There's big clear, big clear trip. I might not even have a voice tomorrow. Oh my god! Not shingles, tingles. <laughs> not the shingles, but the tingles, huh? Yeah, girl. <laughs> well, <clears throat> I've been watching Betty through the weekend, right? God be with you. I know that's right. She was up all kind during the nighttime hours, the morning hours, all kinds of hours. Now, Dad, going. I'm going to need some dedicated people in here. I'm gonna need y'all to start doing something for me. Uh oh, because we we'll to get Val to do it. Because I keep telling y'all when they have these dag on call in numbers, call in. <laughs> I mean, when channels are asking for participation, 
<laughs> okay, cheesy. <laughs> I I expect it. <laughs> Release the Kraken. Release the Kraken on him calling it, y'all. Y'all got to get with it. Come on, hey, just speaking. You're late. You're late, just speaking. <laughs> I don't want to get cussed out, oh, but it would be so worth it for me. <laughs> And we That's can the review. Whole, come we on can review now. the clothes, y'all. Come on now, Div. Travel Gal says she'll do it. <laughs> y'all gotta we need some dedication. <laughs> Could you imagine? Everybody from over here start calling her when she got that calling number. Girl, Girl she probably we're right gonna be clipping, clipping, and clipping it. We're gonna be clipping it, clipping it, and clipping it, and laughing. Yeah, yeah, we are. Oh, that reminds me. Where is? Hold on, hold tight, because remember what we got in our text message the other day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hold it down for a minute. Let me find it. <laughs> Somebody, uh, I'm not going to say who. I don't really know who this person is, but they called in and trolled her a little bit, right? It was freaking hilarious. Where are you? Okay, hold on. God, we talked too much yesterday. Look at this. Just look at this. I got to go all the way up. All the way up. Up, up, up and away. <laughs> Somebody did call in there. It was hilarious. Uh, no, that's not it. Is it? No. Good Lord. How far is it? I mean, Betty even gives the number one finger for everything. She you're number did. one. You are the number one caller today. It was funny to me. Hold on. I'm just going to do this. Hold. Just hold, please. I know it was when she was taking the call-ins. Hold tight. Oh, I'm going to find it. I know the timestamp because I remembered it. Twenty four forty. Just gotta find that damn video. <laughs> Let me see. She's did so many. That's the thing. She did so many this weekend. So I gotta find it. But somebody called in on her little show, trolled her up a little bit. You know, she won't too happy about that. She not, you need to lighten up. She has no, none of these people, <laughs> need to, they just need to relax. They just need to relax. It's a lighten up. All right, God. I'm just going to start seeing what I had lined up to begin with because I'll find it. I'll find it. I'll find it. We need to go on and get going because it's 1040. I got to get my dog in. <laughs> what these clips go, damn it. All right, here we go. This was one day ago. Let's see where she's at. Hold on. Right here. Here we go. Act of violence that happened to Sebastian. No, oh, Lord. At Chris yeah, I had it like, um, so much. I had it stopped at where I wanted it. So here we go. Let me speed her up. Speed her up. Baby, you don't even need to be striking no damn nobody these days, honey. All right. Watch that this. But, uh, Look, at, that Pascal? Look at Pascal's face like he's looking at her. The other one I have pulled up is she's in the damn bed. I swear she's Happy taking birthday, IDL. It's IDL's birthday. Happy birthday, IDL. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> All right, here we go, Val. You ready? Part of their family secret was let out because obviously we know that it appears that Sebastian didn't get the proper help that he needed from an event like this. Well, Chris looked at him as a pedo as a pervert as now that is where i have a huge problem did you hear that val mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. did you just mm-hmm. hear what she said mm-hmm. i heard it to my ears mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. god almighty 
as a, as a monster because of this 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 um, act of violence that happened to Sebastian. And he looked at him and he was so concerned that he was so worried. What does it say? And um, and now last night, Seth told us CP said he needed to wear pull ups. My God. Yeah. And I don't understand how that had anything to do with it. But they did say that. And they said that early on. And you know what? It doesn't matter because Chris now. that Can somebody tell me how this is helping find this little boy? Y'all keep asking me. If it doesn't matter, if it doesn't matter, then why are you discussing it, Betty? Exactly. Mm. We know who Chris is. Uh, if we go back to those interviews that Chris Proudfoot did, and all he did was dog and disrespect Sebastian. Like, you know what? I got nothing to say about Chris. Chris, nothing nice to say about. Him. And that is a lie. I don't think he said anything like that about that child. I might. I mean, you see how she's saying it? She's spinning it. Just spinning it. It's disgusting. Wait a minute. Either they're not giving interviews or they are giving interviews. Mm hmm. Right? Chris yeah. Proudfoot. I got nothing nice to say about Frank. Katie Proudfoot either. Um, um, can't wait to see you face to face. We know, baby. for you. We know. Before, you, be, before anything even got going, you was going, the mama did it. Yep. You've already, you've already got them labeled guilty. Guilty is charged. Because you say so. Look, I sit down. Listen to this, Val. Uh, Chris, Chris, nothing nice to say about Chris Proudfoot. I got nothing nice to say about Frank Katie Proudfoot either. Um, um, can't wait to see you face to face, babe, because I got a mouthful for you. Uh, not a What you going to do? <laughs> Betty, what you think you going to do? What you going to do? That's a threat. That's the whole threat. People are gonna get really hemmed up for us all over it. Y'all, you know if y'all go, if y'all go missing, I can tell you right now, y'all go missing. Betty gonna be sitting over going, your mama did it. Yep. Get ready. Violent person, but I am a damn sure mouthy person, and I've got some things to say to Miss Katie Proudfoot. Um, oh, we know, we know. However, you've been you saying it the say? whole time. She been saying yeah. it. I what know, have, you, I know. What have you not said, Betty? I just want to know who the hell do you think you are? You self-entitled wretched whore. <laughs> God. Who do you think you are? You're That's what I don't understand this entitlement from all these people thinking that, that the police owed him something, the FBI owed him something, the TBI owed him something. Who the hell do you think you people are? Who, who told you you're that irrelevant? Or you're that relevant, excuse me. Who, who told you that? Who guessed you up to think you were important enough? Any of you. The Dollies, the T-Rebs, the Britneys, Bet Bullhorn, JLRs, all of them. Who the hell actually told you people that you are that important to know everything that goes on in a missing child's uh, case? Please well, tell my, me. My thing is, who are we to know who these, like, I don't know these people. It's kind of like picking out somebody on a, a sitting over on a bench somewhere and go, let me tell you all about your life and who you are. Yeah. Like, like they, they know. Like, walk <laughs> over and try that. Like, people are going to be looking at you like, no, you're, you're way off. Yeah. Good. Why it's not good to speculate on people. I know. And assume, because you know what it means when you assume, idiot. When you assume you make me a gluttonous whore. <laughs> he called Seth up with Katie on the phone, by the way. With Katie on the phone. Katie, mm, me and you, girl. <laughs> me and you, girl. I'll be there soon. I'll be there soon. Betty, who do you think you are? What you you making me mad. Me? What you going to do? You're making me mad. Like, think about this. What's, what, is you, what are you going to do? Like, well. Oh. Get out, you. Get out the tingly bullhorn. <laughs> Don't make her get her bullhorn out, y'all. She does blame Katie. I know. Hey, everybody. I see y'all coming in. Hey, everybody. Thank y'all for being here. If you are not a member, I suggest y'all join up because we do do membership only every other week on Thursday nights. So if you're not a member, please become one if you would like. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I'm, Me and you, girl, I'll right? be there soon. That's what um, you, yeah, and, and I'm going to wait until my, my temperature comes down a little bit. But I, I'm 
she knows that she could get in trouble for saying things like this because you're pre you want to talk about some premeditated when your title was yesterday you premeditating going up there harassing and stalking this lady your words betty not mine your words not mine See how that can be turned around on you? You're making me lose my voice today, Betty. How dare you? I'm going to have to go get some lo throat lozenges because of you this morning. Dad, gone it. I'm going to be seeing you, babe. I'm going to be seeing you. I got some. I, I got. I got. I got some help coming your way. I got some help coming your way. I promise you that. Um. Oh. What does that mean? What does that mean, Betty? What oh. does that mean? Let's rewind that a little bit and hear that again. Her whole threat. Because you sure are making them now. You sure are making them. And it's coming from you that's got a lawsuit going on with someone that says they, they had you stalked and harassed and in fear for your life in your home. And look what you are doing to someone else at the moment. Mm. Uh, uh, uh. Sure don't, the math ain't mathing with this situation, honey. You might be... Uh, mm. Again, oh what is the point of this to go? What are you going to do? Be going to beat it out of her? You going to pick her up by her ankles yeah. and put her face in a, a, a bucket of water? You going to wash board her? Yeah, what are you going to do? Because you sure oh, yeah. Like this yeah, a jury of 12 sure will buy that. Yeah, exactly. Hey, she going to go down and save the day. Mm. Man, I'm telling you right now, don't make, me, don't make me go to Tennessee. Don't make me do it. Don't make me do it. Cause I don't like where your little mouth is going right now. Cause you're making some freaking threats here. Yeah, this is not. Listen yeah, this, this is pretty disgusting. This ain't cool. This you're ain't interfering cool. Interfering in a case. You're interfering sure in a is. case. Here we go again. Interfering. You already got J.L.O. His weasel ass got eyes on him down there in Mississippi, stalking them there. <clears throat> Keep right on. You're gonna stalk the wrong one one day. You are gonna end up stalking the wrong one. Cause you keep rolling up on people and inv inv invading their bubble, you are gonna get messed up. The bubble, mm -hmm. your bubble, their bubble. Keep right on. It's gonna happen. They'll get in their bubble, bubble, but they'll get in your bubble. Okay. Uh -huh. And you, hey, congratulations! You might be viral in getting your ass whipped on the live stream. That might be a way you might go viral, honey. Oh, that That's will go viral. He called. Keep right on fucking around with. Excuse me, Lord. No f's before twelve. Okay, sorry. Keep right on messing around, Betty. Keep right on. Seth up. With Katie on the phone, by the way. With Katie on the phone. Katie, mm, me and you, girl. <laughs> me and you, girl. I'll be there soon. I'll be there soon. I'm, I'm jammed up on a car, thank God, right? Thank God. Um, And, and I'm going to wait until my, my temperature calms down a little bit. But I, I'm going to be seeing you, babe. I'm going to be seeing you. Oh, are you a little unhinged? You are ruining yourself this right woman, now. Let me tell you something. <clears throat> this, Betty, you're showing how crazy you are. Yep, your mask is just falling off everywhere, girl. You, you, you really need therapy. Yeah, I wonder you, how she like it. Somebody rolled up on her out there. You really need therapy. I'm just following your lead, Betty. I'll just be following your lead, right? You make you making them rules over here, not me. Right, I got, some, I, I, got, I, got some, I got some help coming your way. I got some help coming your way. Got Me some too. help coming your way. What does that mean, Betty? BTM coming in, been a member for six months. Thank you so much for your support. We appreciate it. He says the judge will be seeing Betty on the 16th. Oh, the 16th. All righty. Well, there you go. Tiss, tiss, tiss. That's right, Brett. I promise you that. Um, BTM, make sure, uh, what's the name, got this clip. So, he goes and tells them that if people know what happens to Sebastian, this essay, if people know what happens to Sebastian, they'll stop looking for him. Tell me that ain't manipulative. Tell ask, tell me how that is. Chris, do you know who your audience is, dude? We're a lot of women. I am been sexually assaulted myself. And you know what? I am going to put my boots on and I'm going to work a hundred times harder for this, this victim of this, this particular. Oh my God. Thank you, Yo-Yo, for being a member for 37 months. Thank you so much. He says it's hashtag Val's fault. <laughs> I'm telling you what, Yoko. Do you hear this? Do you hear her? <clears throat> Most of the time, if you are, or if you, if you are or were a SA victim, that would be the last thing you would get up here and re-victimize another victim with their trauma. Uh, yeah. 
Yeah. Can I be clear with you? I mean, I know your damn brain don't work right. You ain't got no freaking common sense. You need to go in-house, Betty. You need to go in-house. Two words, in-house today. Yeah. Something is wrong with you. Just the the stuff that comes out. And this, once again, y'all, shows the insensitivity of this person. The no empathy for the child. Her, she's so angry and gun ho to get them parents, you know, get on that hate train. She's forgetting. She is harming. She's harming this kid. Has there ever Everyone been any case she's done that it ain't been about hate? <clears throat> yeah. Like it's about the case and not about hate and her ego. I know. And I'm sorry. Anybody that's even repeating that stuff about him. You're re-victim. You, 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 this his story to tell, not none of you. Okay? It's not your story. So mm-hmm. stop it. All of you, just stop it. You're desecrating his memory, his honor. And think about if he is found. God, God, God willing, I hope he is found. Y'all do realize he's got to go. He's got to live the rest of his life. And the internet is forever. And all of you are going to be up here running your mouth about his his trauma. Well, they're bringing more trauma. Yeah. Whatever trauma this child has suffered. Congratulations. Now y'all brought more trauma on him. Because at this point in time, I'm hoping. I, I'm still saying he's alive. That's my hope. Yeah. yeah I think he's run off. And I'm going to stand, I'm going to stand by that. I don't say that's the problem with a lot of these people. They have no hope. They just want to jump on that train. The hate train. You never give up hope. You never, ever, 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 ever give up hope. Until there is no hope. I just hope he ain't hearing all this. You know what I'm saying? If he is out there, I hope he's not hearing what's going on on this internet for real. Because that could be traumatizing again. He ain't never going to want to come back. Y'all have done. You've done, you've heard him so bad. All of you. It is sad, man. This is sad. Particular crime. Christopher Proudfoot. We don't stop because victims of crime were previously victims of crime. I don't know where you come from, but in my neck of the woods, we call people like you pieces of shit. Daddy. Just I, I don't know if the people. Wow. I cannot. Hey In house. <laughs> she needs to go somewhere. She needs 51. In house. She needs 5150 for real. People in the back can hear me loud enough um, with my fury and frustration on how I feel about those statements and how manipulative to try to. Well, I got fury and frustration here in your statements that just came out of your flap. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on now. Touche. Same. You think what you're saying over here is good? No, it's not. It's disgusting mm-hmm. what's coming out of your mm-hmm. mouth. So I'm frustrated and furied up, baby. To stop somebody from saying something, uh, going and manipulating him. Oh my God, if they know, they're not to stop searching. Have you lost your ever loving mind? Do you honestly think we're going to stop searching? You know what, Chris? I got to tell you, I'm a very, very, very kind person. Now, you know what, baby? Your story and your manipulation and your narrative, you know what? What you say out of your mouth, you need to be pulling up the clip right behind it and say, see, he said it right here. That's why you're a joke and you're a liar. She's a liar, Val. You know what's funny? We got all, we again, we've got all these retired law professors legal people dna study people all over this internet right that do cases and talk about cases they're not up here threatening people you know what i'm saying even though they're frustrated they get frustrated at things and stuff like that they're not up here threatening people (laughs) they're not doing this right here but oh, God forbid yeah. you say something about her. God forbid you say anything about her or them other tragedy pimps. Oh my God. Oh, the haters, the haters, the haters. No, uh-uh. you mad because we over there 
explaining what you are. And that's what you don't like. From I'm saying something, uh, going and manipulating him. Oh my God, if they know, they're going to stop searching. Have you lost your ever loving mind? Do you honestly think we're going to stop searching? You know what, Chris? I got to tell we you. We know who's I'm lost their mind. <laughs> we're looking at it. I know that's right. Crazy ass. God. What is wrong with her? Kind person. I am. I'm a kind person. No, you're person. not. I have a mouth on Stand me. Like you, not, you, you must keep saying that to make yourself believe that. You're not yeah, a girl, she get, at all. She's got to get in front of that mirror every morning and say, I'm a good person. I'm a kind person. Every People love me. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. You're on a break. I'm professional. I'm not <clears throat> a professional. Yeah. Mm. I like to cut to the shit. I like to cut to the shit. So yeah. this is what I'm going to do. Shit. I'm not quite sure That's what. about what's coming out over there. Shit. Go ahead. Cheesy says, uh, BTM, she says she wants Chris's RV. She is hoping to sue him. I think, oh my God, she wants the man's RV now. She's oh, got a man. God. Shut up, baby. Just yeah. shut up. But I have a funny feeling when I get into town and I can't find that boy and that boy isn't found, I have a funny feeling you're going to hear from me. You're going to hear from me. So I would suggest. What are you going what? to do? <laughs> What are you going to do? I want to know. What Daddy, are you going to do? I'm pretty sure old Proudfoot ain't watching you. <laughs> She's the only one that ain't been able to get a damn interview. <laughs> I'm pretty sure all of them have a lot more things to do than to sit and yeah, watch well, over here in your gray yeah. shirt with your boob trying to escape. <laughs> screaming and hollering. That's why she's so mad. She's the only one that ain't got a damn interview. When she rolls to town and she can't find him, well, ho. Okay, let me get this straight. <laughs> Over 1,500 searchers couldn't find him in the first, when he first went yeah. missing. The military couldn't find him when he went missing. <laughs> People that have still been there on the ground searching can't find him. But Johan ain't going to roll on up when you get your carburetor fixed. <laughs> when she gets her timing belt fixed. <laughs> and you're going you're gonna to waddle your honey and all the way up to Yogi Bear RV Park. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. Dummy. Yes, this is what I would suggest you do. I would suggest, I suggest you pick up the you phone. Go somewhere else. Go in <laughs> and out. <laughs> okay, I'll calm down. <laughs> Look at you, Patty. You got me choosing anger today. <laughs> you didn't got Val hanged up. It's the eclipse. <laughs> I see eclipse. <laughs> Tell them here, my nun out Call law enforcement this woman. and tell them the truth. Tell them what happened. Katie, you need to get the hell away from that man. You need to fight for your son and cut the shit. Oh, Nobody shut believes up, in you. <laughs> God, I gotta go pray again when we get off of here. <laughs> I gotta go back to the prayer closet. <laughs> Oh, my God. And then you're sitting here threatening this man that we're going to stop searching. Make I hope your people follow you're people. You're threatening him. <laughs> it's getting old, Betty. Just like my face over here. It's getting old. Right. Pulling him around. I hope they're looking at what we do. How we do it. Y'all look at Betty's vein popping in her neck again. We got her vein popping, y'all. We got her vein popping. Look, look, this woman really because believes. Really believes. Look at her. Look, look, look at the eyebrow go up, y'all. Uh huh. Girl. Mount Mama says she drives a Fred Flintstone car powered by her hooves. <laughs> she better get. You. She better get to stepping. Thank you. Thank you for the four ninety nine. Thank you so much. I have a pack. What? I have a pack. 
was dropped in the mail I received this morning. Oh, the package. God, I can't read. Oh, I can't read. Eclipse, girl. Eclipse got me. I can't read. I'm sorry. Purple Passion has got a package to go get, y'all. <laughs> Look at you, Betty. You got you got some stuff over here frazzled back to kindergarten. She can't read now. Read. I can't halfway talk. She got my voice all messed up. I'm going to have to go get some medicine for my thumb. Baby, look what you've done over here. <laughs> you need look to what swing you've done by, Betty, you need to swing by some feel better <laughs> lollipops or something. Good Lord. I need something, some, some, what are they? Ricola. <laughs> <laughs> I need some. Oh, now that's a bullhorn. That's a bullhorn. A big old instrument. Ricola. Ugh. I guarantee there's a whole hell of a lot more people in that town right now after those essay allegations than before. Oh, my God. You should learn oh your audience, Lord. Christopher Pratt. Well, can, I'm going to say this. Betty, stop it. The stepdaddy didn't do it. He didn't do the, the bad thing. Can we, look, can, can we play music right? behind this? This needs to be patriotic. Like, she's whipping up a, a go get them Calvary oh. war, y'all. Pressure, pressure bus pipes, remember? The pressure, the pressure. Proudfoot. Yeah, that's the kind of nonsense that uh, we're learning. So Christopher Proudfoot didn't like Sebastian. Christopher Proudfoot wanted Sebastian. Well, out guess of his what? Home. Christopher Proudfoot. My base is found. Don't like Betty. <laughs> <laughs> and nobody gives a crap. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of people that don't like your ass, Betty. The hell. Good Lord, I, I cannot. Oh my God. A dose of reality with Jen Lu says, Dear BHB, shush, signed the entire internet, all of us. <laughs> Just shut up. Proudfoot was having family problems because of Sebastian. Christopher Proudfoot had had, had scratches you know all up and down his arms. Uh, days me, after I, I, this is what I want y'all to do, right? Y'all know in that movie, with Mel Gibson when he's giving his going into war speech and, it, yes. and everybody Braveheart. turns around and Braveheart flips up, flips up yeah flips up their skirt to the enemy I think that's what we should do to Betty <laughs> everybody everybody just moon her ass in just, the middle of the day, just moon her everybody get outside just moon her ass Kiss I mean right there. In honor of the total eclipse. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh, look, Silver Pug's like mooned. I know, Self Aware. My powers game's on point these days. After this boy disappeared, Christopher Proudfoot has lied over and over again on multiple platforms and during multiple na, interviews. Na, 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 are you screaming? Girl, he's giving her battle cry. That's what her battle cry is. <laughs> she is on her sheep. <laughs> her shield. Yeah. She Run her back and forth that. between her arm and that back and forth. Yeah. She is. She is screaming, y'all. Woo! -hoo. Good Lord, your voice gonna be cracking like mine, baby. Calm down. And I'm sitting Has back there going, looking at my watch, going, "Okay, Betty, I, I, I've only got so long to get on this battlefield, so hurry up." <laughs> like everybody's tired now, Betty. Nobody wants to go fight nothing. <laughs> it's been forty days, bitch. No, like you're always weak. Like no, your your battle cries little long here okay uh, get together yeah. baby in house two words oh no you don't get out of here oh we got trolls we oh. got trolls 
trolls in different area codes coming on in. <laughs> they trying to get me up here with the N-word. Oh, it's up you, Betty. Oh, poor thing. Are you mad? You'll be all right, hon. And then we find out he has not. And then when he's called out on it and pushed and said, hey, we'll set one up. Then he says, oh, yeah, be there anytime, any place. And then he tries to cower out. And then you know what? The TDI steps up and says, well, not so fast, Mr. Proudfoot. We want you to come in. We're going to do the polygraph test. Yeah, because who the fuck cares about Nancy Grace? Who, she's nothing but a tragedy pimp, too. I wouldn't do nothing for her. Show it. And how about even my husband said it yesterday. We were talking. Mm -hmm. And he even said. He might have told Nancy Grace that he would do the polygraph, but I bet his attorney said, don't be doing nothing for her. She's not the police, Betty. Did you ever think about that? Who the hell cares about freaking Nancy Grace? What kind of pool has she got? What, what kind of judge is she? She ain't one. She's just bad as you. Welcome to the main deck, J-Dub. Thank you so much. We appreciate you. That's correct. TBI is going to be doing Chris Proudfoot's polygraph test. And I'm curious what we're going to find once that's done. But I tell you what, we're going to learn one of two things. He's going to come out here and tout that he passed his polygraph test. Are you going to see that man cower down and recluse like what? And when he recluses, he's going to be sitting there. Oh, they're not fair. Oh, they lied, right? Isn't and Betty's going to be right out there. Uh-huh. He he ankles, putting his head in the water. Shh, waterboarding. Mm-mm-mm. Well, my thing is, she just said either way, he's going to be guilty in her eyes. Oh, yeah. They'll call that, right? Yeah. Either way, he's guilty. Either way, he's going to be guilty in her eyes. He may be guilty. But you I can't be just evidence is out here that he actually did something. That's our problem. You're sitting there just crucifying people that ain't even been charged with. And you know, I know why Xanax was made. I know that's right, honey. I need a double. I need a whole bar. You hear me dealing with this hoe? Good Lord. Nancy Grace? Oh, she wasn't telling everybody her truth. Like, Nancy Grace has a dog in this fight, dude. Seriously. She wants... Nancy Grace is a tragedy pimp. I know she's your, your, your... You look up to her. That's who you want to be, Betty, but you never will, okay? You never will. Not with them roots. Not with them roots, girl. It's the truth, mm -hmm. just like the rest of us. I don't want to blame a mom and a stepfather. Do you think that's the top of my freaking list? Oh, yeah, it is. What? <laughs> what? On every case. Every case. The is, she on, is she off her meds? Girl. Is she off her freaking meds? You were just raging 30 seconds ago. Oh, I don't want to, I don't, I don't want to blame him. I, I'm not like that. I, I really don't want to blame him. Yeah, you do, or you wouldn't have nothing to, to bitch about. What? We, you just are. Heard, we just heard 10 minutes of you threatening the mother. <laughs> that you, yeah. You're coming and you got something for her. Right? Mm -hmm. huh. As a matter of fact, I would have preferred never even seeing your stepson's face. But here we are. Yeah, here we are. Here we are. Yeah, here we are. Hearing her yell. <laughs> Thank you for the cash app. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, my God. I Betty. think Betty, so Betty, he, needs, Betty needs to get a cape instead of a horn because she's <laughs> coming to town. Look out the way. <laughs> Betty on the way. She got the cape and the damn mask, girl. Dun, 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 We're dun, out dun. there. We've got men, several going on right now out of the Indian, I think it's the Indian rocks or something like that. People in this um, chat would probably be better suited to tell you, but there is a uh, flag waving right now going on. Um, and they are asking for, um, for Chris to repent. This is going on right now. Oh at the God, a flag waving. <laughs> oh my God. Chris, repent. We demand you repent. Repent, Chris. Yeah, she can get on her broom, can't she, Katie, and fly the hell out there on her cape. Freaking broom. Right, ABG. <laughs> Repent. Listen, and what did that have anything to do for the search for that youngin? Telling Chris Prelfit to repent or he's going to burn in hell. How did that help? 
That's why that young man went rolling up up there and say, how is I this help? help searching for this child? A man oh, has been searching for, for weeks. <clears throat> God, my voice is going bad. To a man, like he, a man asked him, a man asked this dude, the very man that asked this dude, how's this helping, is the very man that's been on the ground searching. Uh-huh. Yeah, that, that, she talking about the flag, wait, it won't a flag, you fool, it was a freaking paste, pasteboard uh, sign. It won't a flag, you weirdo. God, baby, you can't get nothing right, not nothing. Jeez. Miss of everything. Queen says the ones that were holding the repent signs were the same ones that said the searcher came with a pew pew and he had a concealed to carry. He didn't show up or anything. Right, right. Yep, yep. Right. Uh, Henderson, it's in Hendersonville, and I can't read that. Let me put it on a. Actually, let me go. I wish I could. I wish it would just get a little bit smaller. I wish I could stretch it. It's not stretching, but there it is. They're 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 calling for Chris to repent. I think Katie's name needs to be on there because she's she. I'm oh God! <laughs> repent for what? That's it. We're getting a billboard for Betty. Repent, Betty. No, we need a sign. Help the support group that we have to endure this shit every morning. We need our own sign. Help, help us survive. Cause this cheese, her cheese slid right off her cracker. Hopefully. I'm sorry, a woman that stands by her man in this mess. Mm -mm. No, you separate. You separate and get your 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 thoughts together. You find out what happened before you lay next to a man that could have hurt your son. But you already know he hurt your son. And you had no problem laying next to him, didn't you? So. Oh my God, Betty. How would you feel if somebody was accusing you of something you didn't do? Because we don't know, dummy. We don't know. In your delusional, hair-fried brain, you done got him going to jail for the rest of his life. What in the hell is that on Val? What is that? Val, what are you doing? Val, what are you doing? You're muted. What is that picture? Ew. <laughs> She's getting me distracted. So there you have it, folks. We got a lot of stuff going on, including the vigil. If you are out in the area, get out to Rudders. That's 126 uh, River Road. That's in Hendersonville, Tennessee. We are calling anybody and everybody that's out in the area to get your butt out there. Grab you're such the great, you're, you're just such the great uh, child advocate. Your ass hasn't gotten there yet. What happened, Betty? They didn't hit your um, PayPal the other day when you were rattling that can. Huh? That should tell you a whole lot. You're a joke. You are a joke. Val, you're muted. Are you all right? Y'all, yeah, girl, I make <laughs> my... <laughs> okay. I, I had to get something to eat. She making my sugar okay. drop. Jeez. Oh, Lord. My voice and your sugar. Grab a mm. handful of flyers and get those flyers posted up. Those flyers have got to be posted up. There are people that are in the community tearing flyers down. But you know what? We want to make them work for it. So we need to have every single one of those 10,000 flyers peppered across that county. So the people that want to sit there and run around and tear them down, it's going to take them a while to get Now people are tearing down signs. Oh, my God. I can't. We got to move on to the next one. We got to move on to the next one. Like, what really, what is with that, people? Y'all stop it. Quit tearing people's signs down. Well, we don't know for sure. That's actually happened. Well, I, you know, if I'm not mistaken, I think there were people that did verify that. That's over there searching. Stop it. Ah. Okay. All right. I got another one <clears throat> that, that we can watch a little bit of. Hey, there, who is these people in here worrying with me this morning? We ain't had no kind of trouble <laughs> until today. Who's in their why? Wonder why. Who's in their fifis? JLR, are you over here fucking around? Damn, Amanda. Well, let me put another quarter in the jar. I'm trying, y'all. 
girl, I'm going to start raising it to 50 cents. It's in the, it's in the uh, all our links are in the um, description. Merch. Oh, okay. Let me show God about that damn app. Jesus, take that off. That thing is scary. <laughs> oh, my face. How dare yeah. you? That is my age progression. <laughs> Everybody was dropping young pictures and crap. I thought I'd do my. I know, but I mean, you always go get the great. Everybody wants to be young. I, I know, old. right? <clears throat> oh, it's Carlos. Oh, of course, of uh, course, of course. Did y'all know I got a clip? Somebody over there trying to say that I make fifteen thousand dollars a month over here, talking about these tragedy pimps, bitch. Where? <laughs> where? Bitch, I'm bitch, I'm gonna need a raise. <laughs> I know, right? The general manager said it too. Talking about me and Val are gonna need that on vacation. You make it that kind of cool. Like, yeah, right. Yeah, right. I wish. I wish. But no, shit. <laughs> kind of like y'all gold mine. Thinking I got that. I wish. Shit. I have a whole different attitude, probably. Ooh. All right, so this one, this one she did in the middle of the night, y'all. Uh oh. Her, her title, I'm up, are you? Or we can tell you. <laughs> no, Betty, we're not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they did. Great, yeah. I'm with you. <laughs> I got to scrape in the change drawer right now to go get me some Ricola. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my damn throat over here is getting worse. Queen, are they going to be talking about my, my throat sounding worse than yours over there, girl? <laughs> Jesus. Uh, Look at this. this mess coming in here. Y'all know what to do. Just, just whatever. That little trash coming in. It ain't going to defer nothing. So here we go. Uh, she got it in the middle of the night, girl. She ain't even brush her hair. Look at that. Ain't no way in the hell I'm going to pop up here and let y'all see me looking like this. Uh-uh. Okay. I got my bag on no. I got more. Girl, Jesus I Christ. love y'all too much. I love y'all too much to terrorize y'all in the middle of the night. <laughs> well, yeah, I don't want to scare the hell out of y'all looking like this, looking like she's looking. <clears throat> mm. uh, hey, Rachel. We we'll see you coming in tardy. That's at Indian Rocks entrance or something like that. So there's many things going on in and around the um, Hendersonville, uh, Tennessee area over the next 48 hours. Ben, you got on the same shirt as you were wearing just the other day. You got can, on the I same a, can I make a point here? Yeah. Betty, we know. You've been screaming and hollering about Hendersonville for two weeks now. So, Oh, my God. Why you got to tell and your audience that again? They know. Hmm. Hours as uh, volunteers start ramping up the search for Sebastian Rogers. Uh, we've been kind of doing everything we can to support Seth, uh, I think, collectively, as social media has. I, I think that it's not really something we, none of us are coordinating. I can tell you I haven't really spoke to any content creator. but um, Hold up! Content Supporting content Seth by bringing him up on panels and dropping things on him that he didn't know about his son? Yeah. Oh, look okay. at that pause game. <laughs> look at that pause. <laughs> Damn. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let's compare. Wait a minute, don't you move. We're going to compare. She been in the same clothes for five days. Oh, my, my face. Sister. Her face. My face. <laughs> her face. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's a, oh, my God. That is like a twin up there. Jesus. <laughs> we drink the same Jesus. coffee. We got the I same guess. face. Mm. <laughs> no. Tell everybody what we said yesterday when you said you wouldn't a damn Walmart and I'd hit you up and I'm like, bam, get over there and call into that number. I can't do it because she'll hang up on me immediately and say I'm stalking her ass. So you do it. I said, oh, girl, I, I can go over and ask her what coffee, cream coffee she puts in her cream. She in her in her I said, I had a caller from Walmart. I said, bet <laughs> I'm at the Walmart. What cream are you used? <laughs> <laughs> what you suggest? I buy over here at Walmart. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's the craziest stuff we got to do, y'all. 
Oh, she's going to be so mad. She's going to send me a cease and this is ASAP. Oh, Lord. ASAP. Uh, personally speaking to them on the phone. Uh, but I can tell you, most of these content creators are not uh, coordinating with each other. We just know that this needs to be a big push. We just know that uh, Seth is out there by himself, that Katie and Chris have left him behind along with their son, um, and they need help. And so it was just. Well, that ain't what process. you were saying two weeks ago, Betty, when you. <laughs> Girl, I got to stop. She getting on my nerves. <laughs> she, oh, my God. She was sitting there going, you hate social internet? We'll show you. Mm. Stand up, everybody. Because y'all were asked Thank not to film. Yes, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Where we started hearing one person heard this person's going to be out there. Next thing we know, um, it spread like wildfire. And now we're going to have like this massive search Um a group underway and it's not just a hey Betty, group, but it's did you be know that you're getting all you're you're getting all up in all this on rumor and gossip yep <clears throat> mm -hmm. and ain't it ain't it funny that um i didn't see no massive search from any of you people that were out there in the tragedy pimping i saw jim bob and toby in a john boat well, not in the John boat, but they had uh, they were playing around in the mud hole, getting ringworm, trying to say they looking for somebody. Amateurs. We've seen massive. We've seen massive amounts of uh, sitting in front of restaurants and saying warrants are imminent. Yeah, we've seen um, people just uh, milk this shit all weekend long. Yeah, we've seen that. bull crap, clickbait, clickbait, sitting there with your speculation all day, all night. Not really seen much of nothing. Mm -hmm. So, Betty, I, we didn't watch the same thing, dear. <laughs> we didn't watch the same thing. Social media circus. Yep. Group is going to be helping hand out flyers, help post flyers, help do a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, Chris and Katie's story hasn't changed. But the good news is, I mean, their, their story as far as leaving hasn't changed. They're still gone. Their story has changed quite a bit. Um, but we did learn that TBI is going to be administering the polygraph test. So for the people that didn't realize that, you know, Nancy Grace had brought Chris and Katie onto her show. And we were all told by Chris for literally, I want to say weeks. Wait, a couple was weeks the, wait a minute. Katie, the one you showed first, did it come first? The clip you just showed, did it come first and then this one come? Yeah. Good Lord. She's calmed down quite a bit. No, no, no. I think this one was the night and then the other one was the next day, I think. I'm trying to, hold on, I'm trying to do something. Oh, so she got fired up. Uh-huh. Girl, we need know. a cheering section for that. Let me... Let's get fired up! Let's get fired up! There you go, Betty. That's all I got for you. Hold on a second. I got to customize something real quick so I can get this shit not wrong. Uh, where is it? Hmm. Yeah, that is throw that down. Okay, I fixed that shit going on in my chat. So you gotta be subscriber only now. For about five minutes, knock that shit off. We playing that kind of bullshit up here, yo. Crap pass, but also um, Chris, and that all three of them passed the polygraph test. All three of them have been cooperative, and all three of them had been cleared. That's what we heard from Chris's mouth ourselves. And you can imagine how upsetting it was whenever we we watched the Nancy Grace interview, and she point blank asked him, "You you both had your polygraph test, right?" And they kind of paused and went silent for like a dead second. And then Katie, you do realize maybe a uh, attorney has told him not to speak or, or watch what they say with Nancy Grace because she's not the police. <laughs> she's not the police. Oh my God, you're an idiot. He's like, well, well I did, and Chris is like, well, I, I haven't, and she's like, well, why? Well, they said because of my location, they didn't need it. Well, are you willing to take one? Just name the Tate and Pine. Well, we'll be happy to do that. We'll get back to you, sir. Well, Nancy Grace finally gets back to him, and he's like, well, you know, TBI told me not to take the test with you. You know, this is an ongoing investigation, and we're all struggling. Yeah, because she's... Val! Mm -hmm. 
Did you hear that? She could be sitting over there putting herself in an early grave. Oh my God. Look at that pause. Jesus, Betty. Damn. <laughs> look, now. That's what I look like every time I see her talk. I know, right? Oh, uh, that is, right there, Betty. That is how you make me feel every time I hear you talk about cases. Let me get. I, um, I don't want to forget Cheesy's video she sent me about that. Um, here we go. I'll play that before we leave. All right, girl, I want you to say something before we leave. Huh? I want you to say something before we leave. Okay. What? Wait a minute. I'm going to drop it to you. You pull okay. it up. I dropped on this the information eclipse. on his page or channel. Oh my I God. saw it somewhere. I don't know where I saw it, but I saw it somewhere. And it basically said that Chris, you know, Chris Bradford told um, Nancy Grace that um, he, uh, the TBI said, and we're all scratching our heads like, why is TBI giving legal advice? Why would they care if somebody's getting a polygraph test or not? And then we learn TBI has decided to administer it themselves. So now I don't think Chris is going to be able to get out of this one. Uh, He's probably going to do it to shut y'all the hell up. Jesus. You ever think of that? You can't depend. Nancy Grace ain't shit. I wouldn't give her no, nothing. I don't care about Nancy. I don't care about what Nancy yeah. thinks. Uh, he might have been able to blow smoke up, uh, you know, Nancy Grace's butt, but I don't think he's going to be able to do this. So Seth has also agreed to take a polygraph. I'm curious whether TBI is going to be administering Seth's polygraph graph test or if Nancy Grace is going to be doing that. But I did find something, you know, a lot of people are talking about this case and I came across this Twitter post and I thought it was pretty interesting in what they circled. And I know this is. All right. See, Nikki's coming in with a comment. No, BHB is copying what others bought, are, bought from CP, not exactly spelling it out to begin with. I caught what he was saying from the get-go, but BHB is repeating what she saw other tragedy pimps say. Yeah, that's what she always does. All she does is go over there to JLR's freaking Facebook group and gets all her little content, all the rumors. Yeah, all the rumors. it's gossiping rumors. Like, she's screaming and hollering at people over rumors, y'all. Rumors! That's all it is. That's all it is. She's gonna burn the town down over rumors. Yep. Rumors exactly. and gossip. Gossiping rumors not the first time over the last 24 hour news cycle that I heard people talking about this very thing. So I thought I'd bring it up and, and, and see what's going on in the chat, see how you guys uh, feel about it. And it says, here's a theory I hadn't heard before. Uh, is this common behavior for parents in Tennessee? Question mark. If you're talking about the problem. What? Bow. <laughs> Bow. You're done, Bow. You're done. <laughs> You're done. We are a little peculiar in Tennessee. What? <laughs> what moron wrote that in? What moron? What? If you live in Tennessee, you are, you're gonna you're gonna lose your kid. If you live in Tennessee, <laughs> terrible parents. <clears throat> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Was, I I have no words for that. Pirates probably listen. Well, thank God it ain't Kentucky this time. They were wanting just hair. Polygraphs. Behavior for parents in Tennessee? Question mark. If you're talking about the prophets, no, it's not common behavior, but we do see it quite often, and more so probably in Tennessee. We've got the collective few of the parents out there in Tennessee. I, I think you guys need to vote better. I think you need better law enforcement. I think a new sheriff needs to come into town. Me personally, because uh, this is not unique to. Why don't you move to Tennessee and run for it? Get going. <laughs> <laughs> Go try to be the sheriff, the new sheriff or mayor or something. <laughs> I get tired no, of you. No, no, Florida could keep her. <laughs> no, yeah, no, no, Florida could keep. We took a boat. We took a boat. Mm -mm. No, mm -mm. she can't come here. You can't My stay family. here. <laughs> if y'all remember, she will occasionally get get triggered up in her live streams in the morning time. When uh, somebody comes in there and she don't agree with what they say, you're just a hater. What are you doing? You haven't got off your ass yet and done nothing. Well, Betty, I've not seen you leave your house for the past 30 days, boo. So who's doing what? 
uh, the the um, crowd foots. I mean, we got summer wells. I mean, this is. I, I would like to take a moment this, and that, ask other, all you people the out there. If your state's available, let her know. <laughs> oh my God, she can't come here. Uh uh, she can't come here. You ain't coming here, huh? Uh uh. The Lord, the Lord saved your life. <laughs> in that time you were here, Lord, that's all we need. Is, that's all we need is Betty coming in here telling us how to raise our children. <clears throat> she better. Mm, you better hope you ain't never got to come to North Carolina, buddy. You better hope and pray because you got lucky. That was your one chance. Because I was out of state. In my state when I'm out of state. I think she playing that. You know she did. I got to see, um, wait a minute. I want a cheesy thing that she sent. Here it is. Look at Kathy. Kathy's like, I like, we don't even want her in Florida. Hell no. She ain't wanting nowhere. <laughs> Here we go. Everybody else. They have taken one bit of responsibility. It's always excuses when it comes to Katie and Chris. So I hope they're watching. I hope they're watching, by the way. I really do. I hope they're watching the Bloomberg channel. Um, because, you know, there's nothing going to be more honorable for me. And I'm going to work very hard at this, actually. I'm going to work really, really overtime. I don't know if I'll accomplish it, you know. Sometimes I come short. But you know, Girl, I can't hear her. I want that. It, God has answered my prayers. <laughs> you can't hear I shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> you can't hear Y'all can hear her, right? <laughs> Y'all can hear that, right? Tay Barry's like, I got to get a shower for before the apocalypse starts. <laughs> hey, yeah, I got to. I already had mine this morning. I was up at seven o'clock. Yeah, you can. Nobody, nobody wants to be left behind with Betty. I don't know why it's so quiet. It must be. I don't know. They all over it, you know. I want to make sure that uh, the next time you see that coming down the road, hit you know, hooked up on a fifth wheel. I want you to see my name all over it. That's what I really want. You know, I want you to remember what you gave up to try to be a sneaky son of a bitch. Um, I don't believe him. I don't believe him. I know, uh, but city, but you know, this is the, that's in the court system. It angers me that they keep trying to blame everybody else. They haven't taken one bit of responsibility. It's always excuses when it comes to Katie. <laughs> God so, Almighty, she's still watching, going. I hope they're watching, by the way. I really do. I hope they're watching the Bull and Betty channel. Um, because, you know, there's nothing going to be more honorable for me. And I'm going to work very hey, hard. Hey, Munchie Chi. Actually, really, really overtime. I don't know if I'll accomplish it, you know. Sometimes I come short. But you know that RV that you're driving around in, Chris? I want that. I want it to have Bullhorn Betty all over it, you know. She wants an RV oh, just like. Well, put it on your wish list, list Betty, because you got everything else on your wish list. Put an RV on there. <laughs> I know, right? With a wrap. She wants an RV with a wrap with her name on it. I want Dang, that this all big on the yeah. butt of it. Yeah, this sounds just yeah. like the uh day we got the Hobbit mobile right in the day. If you remember, you can see this. Look, he already got his. See, we need look, we need somebody yeah, artistic out good. there to draw us up a um a blowhard Betty RV with a wrap on it. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh, Hobbit got one. He was gonna do the same thing. He got him a little Hobbit on wheels. Now she wants a big. She wants the big dog. She wants the big five, fifth. What is it? The fifth wheel. She wants. Yeah. The big, how are you gonna pull it? Your car don't run. Who? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Betty, you do know you can't have a fifth wheel without a big truck, right? The pet mobile. <laughs> <laughs> That's so fun. Uh, the Bentmobile. We got the Hobbit Mobile, and then we got the Betty Mobile. Mobile. Girl, Devil. you can't touch your car. Devil in red is Robin. Hell yeah. <clears throat> Sitting over there. Can't you get your car running? <laughs> Baby. You can't get your... <laughs> Betty, you can't even afford the tablets that go in the toilet. <laughs> Your toilet will be stinking, girl. Your toilet will her, be stinking. She'll put them on her wish list, Val. You know? Yeah. With her, her box of pins. Everybody report to Betty. And report her mother's her wish, wish list. Her post it. Somebody better get to get in and get that on the wish list. She wants a whole fifth wheel, but ain't got nothing to pull it with. You re you uh, are ridiculous. You are ridiculous. Now, what is this man she just sent me about this daggone? What you gonna do? 
What is it, pal? Put it up. Put it up. Put it up. But the eclipse. Put that up. I got a question. Holy shit. Hold on. I got to put this. Hold on. Let me get it. Let me get it. Let me get it. Let me put it in the chat real quick so I can grab it. Hold tight, y'all. Hold tight. Hold tight, hold tight. Yeah, there's a whole gang of folks out there. Good <laughs> Lord. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm, gonna I'm so be nervous trolling. I can't find my own chat. Damn it. I'm wow. Gonna be, I'm going to be trolling you all day. Oh, my God. I'm so nervous I can't find I can't. I finally found it. Here we go. <laughs> all right, hold on. Let me pull it up. <laughs> Tag on you, pal. Now I gotta go over here. Then I gotta go on the YouTube. You on YouTube. Then I can grab it over here. I'm so proud of you. Look at y'all all the control. Yep, look at me. I'm doing it. I'm doing the thing, girl. All right, I got it pulled up. Good God Almighty. Hold <laughs> tight, y'all. All these folks are getting ready to do. Oh my God. <laughs> They're gonna be in the middle of the earthquake. <laughs> the summer's headed way too close to the water. I know that's right. I Where are the uh -huh. people in Arkansas? <laughs> what? Look, the crowds are gathered at all these places and look at Arkansas. <laughs> Where's Flava at? Flava, get your people. Get look your at people out here. There's yeah, so people know. out there in Arkansas. Arkansas, oh, what's wrong with y'all? Well, they Get didn't out. Have oh, I see them over here now. And now because y'all don't need to be there. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Look at that! Oh, Look at that savage! Look at the smoke coming up. It's the devil coming from the pit. I don't know what the hell it is, but I'm glad I ain't I'm over here. My Lord, my, my I'm in my prayer closet. I'm going to go get Callie from school, and we get in the prayer closet the rest of the day. But no crap, where are the people in Arkansas? <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Where are they? They ain't many out there, is it? No, look. I can't ten, blow it up. Ten, ten people just wandering around a field out there. I Oh, my goodness. Everybody down there in Mexico, look at her. I know. Arkansas, y'all better pick up the pace. No, I know what Arkansas is doing. Arkansas is like, nah, we're not going to go down there until closer to time, and y'all will get stuck in traffic watching it. Okay, I have a question. And I know y'all going to lose your damn minds when I when I think when I say it. I know it's coming. Just, all right, Val. What? Y'all told me not to let my dog outside. What about us? Do we got to wear sunglasses? You need to wear if you're looking up at the sun. <laughs> I would suggest you put on your sunglasses. <laughs> no, Sam. No, Sam. I want you get out there just look up, stare at it. Twenty Come minutes. Out. Twenty minutes. You gotta stare at it for twenty minutes. <laughs> But I don't really understand why I got to have my dog inside. He ain't going to be staring up at the sun. <laughs> like, if they yeah. have to come in, does that mean I, I don't need to be outside? <laughs> <laughs> I'm concerned about you. Everybody's in the sun right now. Everybody's in the sun. Like, like savage, you need special classes to look. Not sunglasses. <laughs> yeah, but why does the I, okay? I'm just gonna stop. I'm just gonna stop because I'm I'm digging well, the hole. That's like I'm in Arkansas. We got our lawn chairs and wielding helmets. <laughs> okay, just in case the dog looks at it. Oh, and you know I did hear something about the animals. They they're gonna start like when the eclipse does like cover stuff. You know, and it gets dark. The animals are gonna start acting like they're ready to go to bed because they're confused. I did read that last night. Yeah, they're doing studies on that. Yeah. Crazy, or not crazy, but at weird. Well, y'all, y'all be better get out there and act weird today because they' gonna be another for twenty more years. So get out there and just act bizarre, people. Hang from bridges with no clothes on. 
This is live. Right here. Do it up. Oh, Lord. Again, yeah. I'm real concerned what about you, people. Like right in Arkansas. In Arkansas. Or the oh, rapture has already right. happened in Arkansas. The rapture has already happened. Look at there. No, shut up. That ain't funny, man. Don't be scaring me up, man. That does not. Their clothes would be laying there, Val. They don't take their clothes when the rapture comes. You go naked. You do. You go people, naked. Your clothes going to be laying there. Not, people do not be coming over here for any revelation studies. <laughs> you go have prayer meeting. <laughs> go have prayer meeting. Because you are right now listening to two imbeciles. Pretty much. Pretty much. <laughs> All right, Val. We're going to go ahead and shut it on down. It's 11.45. I got to get my dog in before he goes blind. And then I got to go get school to boot. But. Baby. Savage, go oh get that baby. baby. You go get that baby before this happens. I'm going to go get you, that baby. You're going to be messaging me. Look, you'll be messaging me. I've got to thinking. <laughs> Dear Val, I got to thinking. <laughs> I'm going to go get that baby now. I think I'm going to go get her out early out of school. I <laughs> <laughs> going to be like, Mama, what, what is what wrong with you, Mama? Mama, yeah, what's you know, what stay here look at the eclipse, Mama? What well, are you doing? You now, I'm going to grab out here so we can want to go get in the house. Come on. Come on. <laughs> check my email. Okay. You may check it before I leave. Let me see. What you got here? What you got, girl? Yeah, I need people to kind of step it up a little bit. We want to see. Crazy. Listen, to me. listen. There's to me. another eclipse coming right across America. It'll make a perfect cross on the center of the nation. God made the first sign go through seven cities named Salem on August 21st, 2017. The word Salem, according to the Bible, is oh, peace. Oh, Lord. Seven times. Great. Offered Just great. This. She'll be listening to this the whole thing. Who's <laughs> listening? Jonah gave Nineveh 40 days. God said you've got 40 days to repent. Only the son of Jonah will be shown to you. And that's right there now. Seven and seven. Seven cities called Salem. Seven cities called Nineveh. And seven years apart. Right oh, the Lord, Sam. City called Rapture. Rapture. Oh, I've got 40 days. We've got to repent and seek God like never before. It's coming very, very soon. You hear that? You, was, you hear that, Betty? You hear that? You better get on your knees. <laughs> Look, ABG is ready. My butt is bare. Step one. <laughs> now go find the bridge, ABG. I want you to hang off there and say, Woo! Sorry, Your Honor. I thought I was. Oh, I know. Time. Time. You good. You good. I'm going to have him in here anyway, just to be safe. All right, y'all. I'm going to wrap it on up, but we'll see you back in the morning if we are still here, if the earthquake didn't take me away in the tidal wave. <laughs> Ow. But don't forget, we'll be here at 11. 11 a.m. tomorrow, we're going to do 11 to 1. That'll be a little time slot, y'all. So mark yep. it down, 11 o'clock, because Val got to go get her uh, doctor appointment. She got to get her oil changed. He does me too, ABG. Mm -hmm. I keep telling y'all, not even the angels know when it's coming. Kels has got her Bible and her flashlight. She's ready. I know that's right, honey. All right, y'all. All right, Bab, tell them. Y'all better get on up there. They ain't going to screw its own stuff up. Not even the eclipse. <laughs> that's right. We'll see y'all in the morning. Y'all have a great day. See you later.